need our channel. I was wondering where you've been. <laughs> uh, you can deploy some sunshine too. Because the weather is crazy. One day it's nice and cozy, and the other it's cold, wet, and miserable. Classic Britain. How you been, my man? How you been? Nice. Well, in that case, I'm definitely streaming uh, Saturday. <laughs> yeah, I've been uh, loose when it comes to my uh, schedule lately. Mainly because not many people showed up for the live streams. So I was like, you know, <laughs> I'm not cutting my sleep short if I'm literally streaming to minus one person. Like, literally. <laughs> Hey, Ian. Back for another round of uh, watching my suffering. <laughs> Jesus, yesterday I was absolutely livid. Mainly because checkpoints are far and very few in between in this game. One, two, if you save the game. The only way to go back to that save, and I was actually thinking about this after I cut the stream. The only way to go back to that particular save, without starting the whole shit all over, is by shutting the game down, loading it up again, and then go back into that uh, saved game, because otherwise... Nope. Yeah, family first, bro, family first. I'm happy to have you if you can jump in, but you know. Yeah. So this is where I made a grave mistake. Saving the game, thinking that, oh, I can just go straight back. Nope. And dying is pretty much the business. Yeah. So long story short. If I don't want to redo the entire thing from the get-go. I have to save the game and exit the game. Like physically shut the game down. And then I get the option to, you know, not redo everything. It's just nuts. I definitely put the bar up high trying to play this. And now I can't remember some of the stuff. So it's gonna be fun. Oh, great. I don't have any fire bombs. And that son of a bitch is hiding behind a pack of probably gunpowder barrels. Yep. Oh, yeah. Trust me, I've been asking myself the same question. Why the hell did I do this to myself? Yep, that took care of the barrels.
Gut. Oh, Jesus, I forgot to lock onto the guy. Well, here's the kick in the teeth. Here I, here's the spot where I got smacked right in the face. So there's one guy and there's one on the side. Oh! Yeah, that's not exactly how I imagined. Somewhere on the line I forgot to put my shield back up. Yeah, so there's the gauntlet. At first I didn't pay attention to the instructions, so all the red stuff on the ground is either a message left by another player or uh, an actual replay of how someone else died on that spot. So before I tried, I read and I just run straight across that was the message and like yeah right i can't see anyone so i stopped for a second and literally it starts raining people <clears throat> i immediately realized why they told me to run I can deal with them one by one, but... Come on! <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, so I got the firebomb guy out. There's the dude with the crossbow up there, but I can't reach that until I go through here, so let's just make it quick. Oh, I forgot about this motherfucker. It's going better than last night. <laughs> Jesus. I'm gonna uh, clip that bit. I I'll literally drop the biggest F-bomb of uh, 2023 when I got knocked all the way back to the start. I was absolutely fuming. If you haven't watched that uh, replay, Fenor, um, do it. <laughs> You'll never see me raging so bad if you don't. I mean, seriously, I even said that compared to this game, Call of Duty is a fucking sanatorium. Ooh. 
Ooh, that was too close. Holy shit balls. Hey, motherfucker. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna do something weird here. So this is the, the number one problem with this game. So right around that corner, there's a whole line of these uh, soul-starved people. Way too many to deal with. And this is where I died the last time. So I'm going to do something weird. I'm curious. But if I die now, Will I be able to load the game back up? Because this is literally everything you get. It loads me up to the point where I am right now. But what happens if I die? Oh yeah, and the, uh, apparently loading up respawns the enemies too. Because de I definitely killed that archer. <laughs> Congratulations, oh yeah, thank you. And here's a replay of how someone else died. <laughs> uh, trap. Okay. What trap? So there's the problem. One or two I can deal with, maybe three even, but that's one, two, three, four, five, and I see at least two crossbows. <clears throat> and to make matters worse, I don't have any fire bombs. I would take care of them, but... Maybe I can... I can lure them in. Come on. <laughs> okay! <laughs> So that's, man, I wouldn't have thought in my life that that are, uh, you know, these uh, stone balls hidden in that crate. Hmm. Okay. I already got farther than the last time. Yeah, apparently someone tried to cut it in their way through. Dragons ahead. Oh, yeah, well. 
There it is. Okay, I'm gonna try something. Because there's no way that I'm going to redo this one more time. If I can't load up the point where I was, then this game is pretty much a no-go because there's no way that I can uh, get through all that without dying. I mean, sure, I can get up to that point and now I even know how to deal with those on the corridor. Okay, here comes nothing. Yep. This is it is this is a joke. This is a really, really, really bad joke. Why would anyone want to replay the same shit a hundred times because you just die? This is... this is just bollocks. I know this bit from heart now. Come on, there you go.
cute. Oh, yeah, straight on my fucking head. Dude, you really, really go and fuck yourself. Seriously. Okay, so now we know that saving the game makes no difference. Saving the game only means that if you are not dead at the moment, you might come back the next day to that point. But if you die... Avoid enemy, okay, well. They don't have to tell me twice. Fuck you.
It would be so nice if I actually saw something, but I can't because the camera angle is just fucking messed up. Man. Oh, that's just great. That's just great. How about actually seeing something from what I'm doing here? Man. I have no idea where I'm going right now. Oh, we're crying out loud. Well, that's a little too many. It's a shortcut, but where exactly? Without the firebomb, I can't deal with those. The thing is, they hit you with that friggin' flaming sword once. And it doesn't matter if you block it or not. So yeah, good to know that there's a shortcut, maybe. When I'm doing this for the mil one millionth time... I'll be able to set those dudes on fire. Come on. Oh, that shit. I dodged the fucking strike. Why did I get here still? If I had as many days off to play games as many times I heard that, oh, this is new, this is new, well, this is worth playing. Yeah. 
Hell, I didn't even get to uh, fire up the uh, compressor and uh, do a test run. And I had the fucking thing on my table for two weeks now. Work sucks the life out of me. But I guess I'm not at all with that. Honestly, fuck this game. I've been playing the same stretch of shit for two days. It's just stupid, plain and simple. Waste of time. The best I can do at this point is just grinding this patch of shit, going back to the Nexus and just keep upgrading things because apparently right now anyone can kick my ass and I'm not happy about it. Oh yeah, how about locking onto the bastards instead of turning me around? You done? How about coming a little closer so I don't get to find that flaming sword idiot as well? Come on, bitch. Oh, and here's another kick in the teeth. Even the cheapest upgrade requires materials I do not get. Not so early in the game. Well, neither did I, but I was uh, kind of curious if I can deal with it. But it's not even the level of difficulty. It's, it's the fact that the game literally punishes you for the slightest mistake you die once and you have to redo everything again and again and again. And there's very few things in life I hate more than doing stuff repeatedly for no fucking reason. I mean, all, all the, uh, okay, fair enough, this is a remastered version. This is before 
the Dark Souls games. This is way before Elden Ring. Hence the reason why the um, progress is so fucked up. Because later on they realize that, okay, people like the challenge that maybe don't like to get raped right up the arse by the game every time they screw up. So they started adding bonfires and shit where you can actually save your progress. But there's no such thing in this one. If you die, that's it. Seriously, I, I, I was doing major face palms yesterday. I wanted to give it a go because I finally got to a point where I could see the end, uh, the light at the end of the tunnel, but it turned out to be a fucking train. And I got ran over <laughs> right after I started. Okay, I'm flipping that. <laughs> Yay, I got a firebomb. That means if I actually survive to the point, I might try to set those bosses on fire. But the chances of me surviving that long are slim. You son of a bitch. Oh. Huh. I've thought of another uh, sort of uh, tactic. Maybe I just keep killing people to a point. Then I let myself get killed, collect the souls, go back to the Nexus and upgrade shit. But the thing is, when you get killed, you drop all the souls you collected to that point and uh, you can pick it up later on. This is the bit that I hate the most. Like, you literally have to time it. Yep, that went well enough. Who's that dude? Oh, suck a fat one. 
Man, fuck off. I want to shoot you, idiot. And now this guy. At least I get back all the stuff I spend to kill him. Hmm. hmm. I'm very tempted to try the shortcut. The real question is, where the hell does it lead? On the other hand, I can try it later. I still have my fire bombs, and I definitely want to have a piece of those two bastards. <laughs> you see that down there? Okay, shortcut. Yeah, that leads into a freaking slaughterhouse. Brilliant. Come on. See? There are all the souls I dropped. So here's the thing, 
you keep on dying and dying and dying, but as long as you know where you broke the souls, you... All you lose is time. A lot of it. There you go. I can keep farming souls, but the problem is, like I said, you need more than souls to upgrade your things. Come on. Oh, I leaned into that one. Firebomb guy. So far, so good. It always goes well to a point. Ah, God damn it! Seriously. Bastard always Dude Knock it off So as I was saying that bastard always blends into the background and we never see him That's just great. You don't tell me that he's still alive. It's... What the hell? If I fall that far down, I'm good as dead. Uh. 
<sighs> Nearly two thousand souls. And this is where I died. Oh. Hey, can I get my souls back? Right. Uncharted territory, which means I'm dead. <laughs> 